when we're looking at a compost windrow like this, um, you can see all the different kinds of organic matter that went into the production of that pile. And as soon as you look at that mixture, once you get a little bit of experience, your first reaction to this kind of pile, if all you had was this visual picture, would be, this is way too high in manure. This pile is 50% manure. <laughs> you can't make good compost out of this unless you really want to be out here turning this every hour. You turn this, the temperature, bang, right back up at 65, 70 degrees. You've got to turn it in an hour. You've turned it, an hour later, temperature's right back up at 65, 70 degrees. You're going anaerobic. You're having a, so if you're not out there turning it right on time, because you put too much high nitrogen material into that pile. If you're not out here turning this on time, you're going to start seeing this problem. Look at the middle of the pile. We got a problem. When you start looking at temperature, out here we're at ambient temperature. So we may be at 15 degrees Celsius, 18 degrees Celsius. But as soon as the microorganisms start growing on this plant material, they're producing heat. They're using up oxygen. So as any aerobic bacterium or fungus starts to grow, they're going to be utilizing that organic matter and their speed of growth depends on how much high nitrogen is present in the pile. This is what determines rate of growth of the microorganisms. The faster microorganisms grow, the more temperature is going to be produced and the more oxygen they're going to use. 